So it is Vlogmas Day 22 and it is, what day of the week is it? Monday. Monday. So I think I stopped filming last night round about when we started to get quite drunk. I think I just said put the camera away. Although I had my phone out with me and lots of my friends wanted to be on camera doing various drunken things. So there's some interesting clips of that I'm sure. But yeah, today is just kind of blah day. I'm going to spring break tonight um, in town so I'm home now. And I just had the most amazing bacon cheese roll. Delish. But I'm feeling a little bit hungover so I'm going to go to sleep for an hour. So that's not very exciting but I'll sure and but um the concert tonight is 80s themed and we're all fa doing fancy dress and stuff so I'll try and get um footage of my outfit before I go and that'll probably be it for today but um I just want to show you something I got where is it so a, com so a company contacted me um and asked if I wanted to get sent some clothes and I was obviously like yes yes I do the company's called Dresslink I hadn't heard of them before but they're like it's kind of hard to explain I'll leave a link to them in the down bar but it's like they're an Asian um, clothes company. Um, their stuff is like really nice. When I was looking at it, I thought this looks really nice. I hope the quality is good because the price of things were like five, six, seven dollars for things. Now, the, um, they are based in China, so th the stuff did take a month to get here. But I think don't think that's normal. I think the the woman I was emailing about it said that um, must have gotten lost along the way or something. So I don't think that's normal. But obviously, it would take at least eighteen days to get here from China. So keep that in mind if you're ordering from there. But I'll show you what they sent me and I'm just so happy. I picked these out obviously, but um this uh, the skirt. This is like the Zara one that everybody in the world has. And like I did always I remember I just at the time when these came out I was like, no, I definitely don't want them. They're so common now. Um I didn't definitely didn't want the white one. But I've seen this in Zara since and I was like, oh, you know what? It's actually not really that faddy because it's quite just very, very plain. That like it's something I think you could wear. Um for like a long time and because it is actually quite a classic pleat piece but anyway I didn't want to buy the Zara one so I got this one I think this was like seven dollars or something and it has the skirt and it has the shorts on the back and it, they're really good quality they're really thick now weirdly enough um it says like it's so weird so it says large here and then it says like medium in all the other um sizes which is just really weird and it also says a 39.95 and that's in the same text as Zara so it's very odd, but um, when I was looking at the sizing, it did say that like a uh, large is a size 8 to 10. So I was like, that is so weird. But they are Asian sizes, I guess, so they're a lot smaller, but that was just kind of odd. But um, it's definitely not the same as a Zara one. I think the material is different. And it definitely wasn't 40 euro. It was like 7 or 8 dollars. So I don't really know where they're getting this stuff from, but I like it. Um, I also picked out, it's very wrinkly now, so you might be able to see it. But it's a crop top, but like, you know that baseball style t um, tops? That's basically what it's like, and it's really long sleeves. And again, this is really nice feel to it, and really like thick and soft. And it's just a really nice um, crop top, and it's kind of different. And they actually have these in American Apparel, so that's pretty cool. Um, again, this is a large, um, so keep that in mind if you're buying it, that a large is apparently a size 8. Bizarre. Um, and then I also got this top that I'm wearing. Sorry, I look state of me at my stripe and stripe. Um, it's just a plain stripey t-shirt. To be honest, I thought it was going to be a lot more oversized. I think it actually was advertised as oversized and like, sorry, you can't see it all. It is just clearly not. It's actually tight. Um, but it has a nice pocket detailing. I'll show you there. Um, on the boob area. And I think it's just a really nice casual t-shirt. Um, I think this is four dollars or something. Everything was under seven or eight dollars, which is insane. And then the postage, you could you could have gotten the option to track, but I just got the option to um get like normal um whatever delivery. I think that was another five dollars. So all these things together, these three things, including uh shipping, was twenty dollars, which is like What's that, 15 euro or something? That is just insane. I'm really, really happy with the skirt, especially, because it fits really well. So, yeah, I'll leave a link to them in the down bar. And, yeah, I'm really happy about that. And it's like a little early Christmas present. And, yeah, it's pretty cool. Also, another word, another news, my my uh, present for Dave finally came into Harvey Norman. So I am so delighted with that. It is the, um, heavy. It is the Bose Soundlink Mini. It's like a Bluetooth speaker. And, um... Yeah, I just think it's really nice and I'm really happy it came in. I was like so annoyed when it wasn't going to come in. Um, but yes, yeah, so I'm happy that's in. And that's all. So I'm going to go nap now. So I'll see you later. Bye. Oh, hey. Here's my outfit of the night. I'm just, you know, going to the club with some friends. No, well, obviously not. I'm going to spring break and this is my outfit. Do, do, do. Converse. <laughs> oh, God, this is so much fun. 
kind of like a Chav 80s person, if Chavs existed in the 80s. I think this is what they would look like. Beautiful pink eyes, scrunchy. So yeah, that's what's happening. I'm gonna go now and be 80s for the night and go see spring break. So I will see you tomorrow. Do get papa. See you later. It is the 24th of December. What the fuck? What the heck? How quickly has this come around? And I know that everyone's probably saying that, but like, I'm doing it, I'm like measuring this in terms of Vlogmas. I definitely don't feel like I've been filming Vlogmas for a whole month or that I've been watching Vlogmas for a whole month. It's just bizarre how quickly this has come around, but yeah. It's Christmas Eve. Vlog yesterday, you'll know that I was at uh, Spring Break last night. Spring Break are like an 80s cover band and they were playing in the Button Factory. And, um, oh, my nose is dripping. <laughs> Sexy. Um, no, they would play at the Button Factory and it's fancy dress, so you dress in all 80s gear. And if you saw my vlog before this, you'll have seen my outfit, but if not, check it out on Instagram. Oh, it's very funny. My name is Roisin Thor on that, by the way, so very simple. But yeah, it was just such a good night. I drank so much alcohol, though. I um, I actually am quite hungover, but I'm just, you know, I think when you're hungover and you're in a good mood, uh, like, it's not as bad. So I'm just hungover, but I'm just not going to think about it, and I'm just going to enjoy Christmas Eve. Um, But yeah, I think I'm going to stop filming this afternoon and get this video uploaded today on Christmas Eve, because... I don't want to have to edit tonight and I don't have to edit on Christmas Day and I don't want this to go up after Christmas Day because I just think that's irrelevant then. So yeah, I'm going to kind of stop filming this afternoon. Nothing much is happening today. I just, on Christmas Eve, usually my mom just makes me clean the house and cook things. So it's not really that exciting. And then we go to Mass in the evening and then we just come back and we go to the pub and it's kind of just nothing too interesting. But yeah, I will try and get some footage today um, if there's anything happening. But... It might just be a little, a little, a little bit of today. Um, but yeah, that's all for now. So I'll catch up to you later. I'm going to go eat everything in sight. Good plan. It's all good. Um, is that, was that honey? It's whiskey, uh, maple syrup, red currant jelly, uh, balsamic vinegar, and spices. Yum. Where did you get that recipe? Yummy! Yeah, filmed my dad glazing the Christmas ham. It looks so delicious. I'm so excited to taste it. Oh, it's the glaze. It's all about the glaze. Mm. And another positive thing today is that main Chelsea is on. And I forgot that it was on last night because I'm getting all my days mixed up. But I forgot yesterday was Monday. And main Chelsea's on. And there's some sort of terrifying bald cat. Hold on. Mark Francis is definitely the best of this whole whole series. And that weird bald cat. Phoebe's a bit of an Egypt, isn't she? Anyway, that's all for now. I just thought I'd tell you about the ham and made in Chelsea. Good. Another beautiful day in Ireland. Lovely grey skies, lashing rain. Getting soaked. I'm wearing my full don't know if you can see. Let's go again. Full Sherling coat. My vans. A scarf and my furry headband. I'm still with God, it's actually just a little raining on me now. So Tomorrow's gonna happen. Keep off, Connor. <laughs> oh, delicious. Hi, guys. So, um, I it's like half five now on Christmas Eve, and yeah, basically, um, I just had to run some errands today. I'm after making a squidgy chocolate log that we're gonna eat on tomorrow. And oh, there's this amazing ham. I'm just eyeing it up. We're gonna have to have dinner tonight. So yeah, I'm gonna actually end the vlog here because we're going to mass soon and then I'm gonna come home and chill out and watch a movie and I don't wanna edit, so I'm gonna edit this quickly now. But yeah, so I just really wanted to say a uh, huge thank you to everybody who watched my vlogmas and who um, commented on my videos and liked my videos and all that. That was like, cause I just started um, YouTube during the summer, I just, I was kind of think felt like I was taking a risk doing vlogmas. I didn't know whether to do it. I was very apprehensive, but um, yeah, I'm really really happy with the response, and I really enjoy doing it. And just yeah, so I guess thank you so much for everybody who watched it. Um, I really really appreciate it, and I really appreciate all your positivity and just your views and your everything everything. So thank you so much, and I hope you all have an amazing Christmas. It's so weird that. 
Christmas tomorrow is actually so bizarre. But yeah, I hope you all have an absolutely amazing Christmas and the next time you'll see me will probably be a what I got for Christmas video, so that'll be exciting. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for everyone who watched and sorry the lighting here is probably mental. And yeah, I just hope you have a really, really good Christmas. Um, yeah, just thank you again. I'm really, really like, I feel very warm inside every time I put up a video and I get nice responses. So yeah, go to bed early because Santa is coming in the morning. Thank you so much and I hope you've enjoyed Vlogmas and I will see you very soon. Bye, happy Christmas! <laughs>